my name is Luna Page. I'm a singer-songwriter. And I thought I'd chat a bit today about the value of collaboration. Now, the only way that I can really share my thoughts on this is by sharing my own experiences. I was initially quite afraid of collaborating and I realized now that it was because I was scared to make mistakes in front of other people or because I felt insecure about my abilities either on the piano or vocally or on the guitar. The thing is, as I mentioned in the previous sessions, is that it's important to work with people who make you feel safe, that create a space where you are allowed to be vulnerable. Because without making yourself uncomfortable, there's really no space for you to grow. So the first time I collaborated, it was with two actresses. And what really stood out for me in that experience was the difference in discipline between actors and musicians. What I took from that experience was how amazingly effective it can be when you deliver a song, when you use your whole body to express what you're feeling. That's what actors do. The second one was the discipline, their work discipline. Um, what I realized, okay, actors usually go to university where they study and one of the things that they get taught is professionalism. And this is something that really rubbed off after my experience with working with actors. The second time around, I worked with Gerald Clark. Now, Gerald Clark used to play a lot of gigs where he played in front of huge crowds of people who were busy partying or were just chatting away. And he was a solo guy and he could really rally up, you know, that crowd very easily or draw them in. And that's experience that I did not have. I was used to playing in theatres where people came to watch me and me alone. They kept quiet and you sort of do what you want to do. You spoiled in a way. After touring and performing with Gerald Clark, it became very evident that there is something to say for someone that has the ability to read their crowd and adapt and be versatile and have a whole range of material in their back pocket to pull people in. Besides that, he also gave me incredible love and respect for the blues, which led to me actually exploring the blues, starting to sing the blues, which later on affected the whole way that I sing my own songs. And it gave me a new type of a vocal freedom that I'm now thoroughly enjoying. Um, and that took me into the world of jazz by accident. If I didn't work with Gerald, if I didn't make myself uncomfortable, I wouldn't have stumbled across the blues. I wouldn't have start, done my own blues show and I definitely wouldn't have stumbled across jazz that I'm currently exploring. Another example is someone like Nick Turner and Jamie Jupiter, who I worked with. Both of them find a very strong inspiration in local African, South African sounds. And subconsciously, by working with them and just singing along to their songs, accompanying them on the piano, when I started writing new material, all of a sudden I had this African flavor in my songs, something that I never did naturally. It was something that I wanted to do, but I didn't feel it. And just by playing with them, both of them, for almost two years, put me into that spot. Another example would be someone like Fraser Barry that I have now recently worked with in a project called Smelt Cruz. And Fraser is an Afrikaans hip-hop artist, singer-songwriter. And what was really interesting for me was to see how he, every single song that he basically writes has, has got a very laden topic and it's, it's heavy um, content. Yet somehow he writes it in such a way that it's an uplifting song, it's catchy, it's got a vibe, people resonate with it and are not remotely scared by, by the heavy content he's singing about. And just by working with him for a very short period of time, I felt extremely inspired, inspired and also motivated to start trusting my own need to express myself and things that worry me in my music and not being afraid to do so and after working with him for a little while i wrote my first song two or three songs really that actually addressed topics that i am really serious about in my own country and 
I realized that I shouldn't be so scared. He's not scared. He's doing it. So basically, in essence, what I'm saying is, is that we learn from each other. If we trust each other and we feel safe with each other and if we don't feel that we're competing with each other and we're just there to learn from each other, the most amazing things can happen. And that's why I think it's important to collaborate every now and then. Get yourself out of your comfort zone. Expose yourself to people who do things different than you do and see what happens. Give it up, give it up.